It's my first speech here, so I would like to introduce myself briefly. My name is Sunny Fong, the CEO and co-founder of SoPay. I'm also the, the co-initiator of MetaID Protocol. Over the past year, my team and I have been working to build MetaID related infrastructure and applications. It is the most exciting technology I have been involved in my life. And we think most best applications should be built on it. I will introduce this incredible technology to you and show you why we believe it, it is so important in the last few minutes. Now let's take a look at our mobile phones. There are dozens of applications on our phones which have greatly facilitated our lives. But at the same time, these applications also form data silos, which means they have been turning the data generated by us into their possessions and not allowing access from any other applications. What can we do that? What can we uh, to do to change that? The answer is that we can rebuild a better internet on BSV by using MetaID. In fact, breaking these barriers is just one of the small goals of MetaID. Its power is way more than that. Now let me explain what it is and how it can do that. MetaID is a decentralized identity sub-protocol of MetaNet. It is open source, permissionless, and regulates how user and application data are stored on blockchain. Do you remember when MetaNet was released? Dr. Craig first proposed it in December 2018. He also said that the internet would become the sidechain of MetaNet, which caused great controversy at that time. But now we fully believe in his vision because we have more than one year experience with MetaID and have built a bunch of MetaNet applications. We found that what Dr. Cray said is, in fact, possible. MetaID is the exact protocol that makes MetaNet becomes the next generation of the internet. Let's see why MetaID is important. Just imagine a world where Facebook and Telegram can be interconnected and sharing contacts. No hacking, no data loss, and no banning of any of your social accounts. Using one password for all applications and all data truly belong to you. Yes, these are the goals that MetaID will achieve. And totally, and today we already have the ability to build the application with MetaID like that. After more than a year of infrastructure development, MetaID grows rapidly. According to our rough statistics, more than 80% of the block size and minor fees in recent months are contributed by MetaID applications. What on the screen is the data about MetaID as of the end of September. The number of MetaID users is more than 60,000. And the total number of transactions has exceeded 2 million. Now, we have more than 20 MetaID applications. More importantly, MetaID protocol and infrastructures have become mature and stable now. The ecosystem of MetaID is becoming more and more abundant. Now it can be used on a large scale. Version 1.0 of the MetaID protocol has been released for more than one year, just like BSV protocol. It is a set in stone version. We already have two data service provider, more than three wallets, and a variety of MetaID based applications. There are two data service providers, SoPay from us and MetaID.com, which is located in Japan. They can provide convenient MetaID related services for MetaID applications. As for wallets, more than three wallets support the MetaID protocol now, including Dot Wallet, Settle Play, Show App, and WeBot.sv, which is not listed on the slide. In the past 12 months, more than 20 MetaID applications developed by five teams 
have been in have been launched. These applications cover social networking, tools, games, and so on. Every day, people use these applications to create a large number of Meta D transactions. The number of Meta D application is still emerging. We estimate that it will take up to one to two years. We will have Meta D applications covering most types of internet applications. I will pick a few applications to introduce to you. Through these applications, you will better understand the characteristics of Meta ID. The first one is Soul App, a social app where people can chat privately and in groups. It is also the notification center of Meta ID applications. Every time you gener generate an interaction within Meta ID applications, such as getting comments and likes from your friends, you can receive a notice in Soul App. The second one is Metaphoto, an on-chain photo album developed by a third-party developer, where you can store your precious memory on-chain permanently. What's interesting is, due to the interconnection of metadata, it can also manage the photo uploaded from other metadata applications. The next is SoBuzz, a Twitter-like social media platform, but all the data is accessible, permissionless, and can be reused by other applications. The last one is a game, the 2048. Every time you have a new record playing the game, you can get your friend updated on SoBuzz and so app and etc. All these applications can be developed by different teams, but they are all sharing data and interconnected. So you can see, this is just like a huge app. The data inside is free to flow. But different teams develop, develop the different features without a central leader. Also, there are more than 20 applications now. It is far from enough. There will be thousands of applications on MetaID in the future. Applications built on MetaID cannot only interconnect other applications, but also enjoy these benefits. The first, lower development costs and shorter development time. Time is money, right? And the second, build your, build your application based on a large number of users. The users on other meta -D applications are also your users. This can solve the cold star problem of a traditional application. The third, Revenue can be generated on the first day the application goes online. And compared with the traditional development model of internet applications, the most significant advantage of MetaD-based development is that the cost is much lower. Let's take developing a Twitter-like application as an example. For traditional development, we leave front-end developers backend developers, and data engineers for human resources. For the development based on MetaID, we only need the front-end developers. And the workload of traditional development is something about database design, backend programming, front-end programming, system maintenance, etc. But the workload of based on MetaID only involves front-end programming. And the time to build a traditional Twitter night application should be at least 60 man days. But if we build a Twitter night application based on MetaID, it only takes about 20 man days. The business model of a traditional Twitter night application, you know, heavily rely on advertisement to generate incomes. But the application is based on Meta ID. If the application is based on Meta ID, we can have various means of revenue. In our practice, the cost will be reduced by 60% if the app is based on Meta ID. We have only one world, only one internet, 
in the future, it's hard for me to imagine that the world is composed of multiple chains. And it is even harder to imagine that the ID system of applications on the blockchain is separated from each other. One world, one chain will become a reality. And one chain, one ID will become a reality too. I now appeal that all BSV applications should be built based on a decentralized identity protocol. And MetaID is the best solution on the table. As more and more applications join MetaID, we will foresee that an interconnected MetaNet will be achieved. The number of BSV users will increase rapidly. And there will be more opportunities for us to rebuild a better internet based on BSV. And user can get a truly decentralized giant application with a better user experience. Most important is building on MetaID is a better business with higher revenue. If we continue to build applications without a decentralized identity protocol, we will get applications that their data are separated from each other. We will get a MetaLab much lot much better than the internet that we have now. Whether you are a typical user or a developer, you are welcome to join us from these channels. On the left is Sobus and the domain is sobus.app. You can talk anything about MetaID with thousands of MetaID supporters. In the middle is the MetaID101.com. It is a website for developers. You can find all development resources on that. At the right is our Telegram group. Welcome to join us. Thank you for your time. And I hope to see you in the world of MetaID. Thank you. Thank you very much. Data is double-edged. Wield it well and build your place in tomorrow. But trust it blindly and risk watching your progress crumble. Because much of the data we rely upon isn't reliable at all. At Enchain, we believe in data, but we put no faith in it. Instead, we build tools that enable enterprises to trust the data upon which they rely. Enchain, data without question. Bitcoin mining, Bitcoin wallet, blockchain, stable coins, Metanet, the evolution of money. Everybody is talking about Bitcoin today. But what exactly is it? Learn the basics from experts. Learn what Bitcoin is, how it works, and why it matters. Bitcoin 101, your ultimate guide to the fundamentals of blockchain.